hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is louis uefo so in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to use a melt spray so if this is what you're interested in this video is definitely for you and you need to keep watching If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to give this video a very big thumbs up. Like my other videos, watch them, share them with your friends because sharing is caring. And also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you always be notified whenever I post a video. So guys, let's dive right into it. So I have this melt spray from Love Beauty on Instagram. I'm going to be leaving the link to their Instagram in the description below. So guys, that's what we're going to be using for today's video. Then um, all you need for this um, process is a makeup brush. It depends, it doesn't matter. Any makeup brush can do this, but make sure it's a small brush that wouldn't spread the product. Then also you're going to be needing an edge control brush or a toothbrush. So then um, first off, I'm going to be spraying um, the melt spray on the edge brush and then I'm going to use it to like control the hair backward so you guys if you watch closely you see i'm not spreading it or i'm not extending it rather to um the strands so i'm just doing like um an inch from here to there so i'm just going to use the brush to like push the hair backward from ear to ear So guys, once I'm done with that, I'm going to like spray into the cover of the container. Then I'm going to get the brush and then I'm going to just tap tap on the hairline. So if you guys look closely, you see um, there's the white line in front. So um, I don't know why it's happening this way, but um, I believe after, or I know after spraying or using my milk spray, it's going to like blend into the person's skin. Initially, I used um, the person's actual skin tone for tinting the lace. So then um, I'm just going to tap, tap, tap and do for, you know, from ear to ear. So then after that, I'm going to then get my elastic band and then tie it. 
so you guys i did i recently did a video where i talked about five or i gave five secrets on how to like achieve a flawless frontal installation so i'm going to be leaving it up there so you guys can go watch it and also you know learn one or two things from the video So as soon as I'm done with this, I'm going to get my elastic band. So it's the regular band you put, you know, underneath your wig to make it tighter. So I'm going to just stretch it and then place it on the hairline and then ask the model to hold, you know, on both sides so I can then tie it. So usually when I'm doing this, I like to leave it for um, from 20 to 25 minutes so it can actually melt down very well. So you guys, I'm just using my comb to like spread the hair because I have the melt spray already in the hair and I don't want it to like clog on the hairline so it wouldn't make that part really strong. So that's why I had to use my comb to like spread it. So guys, this is the outcome. It's looking all flawless and that's the melt, the, the what lace illusion. So the melt spray actually helps to like give you that what lace illusion so um that's it for today's video i hope it was really insightful and you guys really enjoyed it please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're yet to do that and also don't forget to give this video a very big thumbs up like my other videos watch them share them with your friends because you know like i always say sharing is caring and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you always be notified whenever i post a video so guys is there anything you'd want to see here on this channel please don't forget to leave it in the comments below and i promise you guys i'm going to come through so i love you all to the moon and back and i'll see you in my next video bye bye